so hello friends today we are going to talk about the topic fetoplacental unit so fetoplacental unit or the metano fetoplacental unit as it is called consists of three components that is the fetus the placenta and the mother So this function of the major fetoplacental unit is to provide hormones to the mother through the placenta as it lacks certain enzymes. So the basic substrate for any hormone that is steroidal is going to be cholesterol. Plus LDL. So this is also available in the mother and can be easily transported in between through the placenta also. So this cholesterol plus LDL forms the substrate for the formation of pregnenolone. This pregnenolone cannot get converted into dehydroxyepiandrostenidione because of the absence of 1720 lyase in the placenta. So, this fetal adrenals convert pregnenolone into 17 dehydroxyepiandrostenidione and this is transported to the placenta with the removal of a sulfate group with the help of the enzyme sulfatase. So this dehydroepiandrostenidione is converted to androstenidione which further converts to testosterone. So this testosterone is converted to estradiol. Here androstenidione is converted to estrone. Further, this 17-dehydroxyepiandrostenidione again undergoes hydroxylation in the liver forming 16-hydroxy-dehydroepiandrostenidione sulfate. Again, this enzyme is absent in the placenta. Hence, we are getting this enzyme from the fetus only. So, this again undergoes removal of a sulfate group forming 16 hydroxy dehydroepiandrostenidione which provides the most important substrate which is going to be estriol. So this estriol is going to assess the uh, pregnancy and uh, it is important as this uh, value is lower in cases of Down syndrome. and hereditary form mole.